Good afternoon, Americans. <clears throat> this is your favorite alien, and Bubba, here on the afternoon of Saturday, April 27th, 2021. Stand by for commentary. Well, Americans, I see the ineptus is not only in the Chauvin trial, <laughs> it's all the way up to the presidency of the United States. President Biden today issued a declaration that there was an atrocity in 1915 by the Turks over in the uh, hundred uh, or a million Armenians were killed. Now this is mind you during World War One, okay? President Biden, why didn't you contact your predecessors? President Carter for one, and George W. Bush, Bush for a second one, Clinton, and asked him, why didn't you do this on your administration? And the answer is not, quote, we didn't want to anchor Turkey. That's not the answer. You have opened the Pandora's box here. Sure, there was an atrocity there in 1915. The Ottoman Empire was vicious. Okay? And so was everybody else who fought World War I. The Germans were vicious. And uh, the British were vicious. Yeah. World War I was a disaster. Fought over alliances. The Central Powers and the Allies. And the empires, Austria-Hungary, that lost, they're no longer there. The Ottoman Empire, no longer there. The German Empire, no longer there. They lost a lot. The British Empire became bankrupt. President Biden, what were you thinking? On this issue with the Armenians, and they're pushing you, I know, those guys in California. Armenians are like the African Americans pushing their stuff. They don't understand what kind of problems they're going to get. The problem that you had is you should have gone to the United Nations and your predecessor should have gone to the United Nations and say, we need to set up a document that human beings are not responsible on this date and set a date that us of this date were not responsible for the actions of our ancestors. Now, in 1915, the Ottoman Empire consisted of more than Turks. And there was a lot more people that were involved in that so-called genocide than Turks. Okay? But that's 106 years ago. 106 years ago. Most of the people are gone. If you were 20 years old in 1915... That means that you were 106, so you were 126 today. Really? Do you understand what I'm saying, President Biden? I love her. And this is what you don't understand. Why did you issue that declaration? You're opening Pandora's box here. You should have told the United Nations that we have to set up a declaration saying that as of this date and set a date, all nations in the world are not responsible for the and the deeds of their ancestors. Why were you so stupid to make a declaration like that? If you're going to make a declaration like that, you should also make a declaration like Japan should be acknowledged for the atrocities they committed in Nanking in 1937. We should acknowledge that we committed genocide in 1945 in Nagasaki and Hiroshima and Dresden. The Chinese committed atrocities and are committing atrocities in Tibet and also during the Cultural Revolution in the 1960s. Yeah, but you won't do that because I would anger China. You won't do that because I would anger Japan. See what I mean, President Biden? The best thing you could have done as a president was take this to the United Nations and say, this issue with Armenia declaring that there was a genocide in 1915 by the Ottoman Empire, not the Turks. 
Turkey didn't become in existence until 1923. Do you understand, President Biden? Really? Do you? From 1915 to 23, that's eight years later before Turkey became a nation. So you're condemning the present generation of Turks for their grandfathers and great-grandfathers' misdeeds of 106 years ago. And Armenians, you're acting the same way African Americans do here in the United States. We need reparations for slavery! Because the Americans of today had nothing to do with the slavery of then. Their descendants. The whites of today had nothing to do with the whites then. This is the issue that I've been pushing for all along. And then President Biden actually opens the Pandora's box. Because here, the United States could be the atrocities that you committed against the Indians here. Against other countries. El Salvador, Guatemala, Iran in the 1950s. Yeah, you see what I mean? Invasion of Panama in 89. The actual uh, disaster in 1964. See, you opened up the Pandora's box, President Biden. And, and you can't go say to China that, uh, hey, we can't condemn you for the atrocities that you committed and are committing in Tibet. Or uh, the Russians' atrocity in Syria. Right? Yeah? Really? This is the problem that you have. You have to set for all these old-time grudges that you got going on here. You have to set up something that, that you are not responsible for the accountability of the ancestors. But you're responsible for your own deeds going forward. And that's what you guys should do. Everybody in nation in the planet should go to the United Nations and set something like this up. Stop this from happening. This is your favorite alien in Bubba. How stupid can you get? Good day.